hi and welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will uh, paint this dark purple grape easier and quicker process it didn't take me long to paint one grape so let us start first step is to map in the bloom areas with the lighter bluish or purplish color so first wet on dry i'll add in the lighter bloom color the lighter purplish blue color that on dry wherever the bloom areas are these grapes are part of a big fruits painting on uh, in which i have a variety of fruits i'll reveal the full painting at the end of this video this painting spanned months and it took me a few months to complete the full fruits page softening Where I see hints of grey present, I am mapping in the grey colour wet on dry. Softening because we don't want any hard edges in our painting. Wet on dry mapping in the base uh, yellowish color which I see on the stem. Yellowish brown color. Now I've added water all over the grape and we'll do wet and wet and drop in the darker colors wet and wet. Don't add any color in the bright highlight areas, the lighter areas which we want to preserve light. If your wet and wet layer starts to dry, don't drop in any more color. Just soften wherever needed and leave it to dry completely and lift anywhere quickly wherever needed before it dries. So now the first layer is completely dry and wet on dry. I'm darkening and shaping up the darker areas and softening wherever needed. You might need to build up the bloom areas also with another layer wherever they are darker. So look at your reference and your painting and build up the color and shape accordingly.
Continuing the wet on dry building up of color all over the grape. Some dry brushing to map in some texture where I see the grape is more textured. We paint uh, the plum also, which is also a, fruit, a dark uh, purple fruit, which has bloom. So that one is a full tutorial on my Patreon. You can check it out at the link below if you want to join us. Uh, there is a full tutorial on painting a plum on my Patreon membership. Now wet on dry, I'll build up the green areas of the stem. Darken the brown areas and map them in wherever needed. Wet on dry, shaping the stem and darkening the green areas wherever needed. Dry brushing to build up some more color and texture on the grape. After the previous layer is completely dry, then only do the next layer. Now switching to a smaller brush to add in more texture with some more dry brushing. Some more wet on dry to shape the stem. I shaped the stem a bit more later off camera also. Uh, later in the painting because this painting is a full uh, collection of fruits. I'll show the complete painting at the end. Wet on dry mapping in the shadow of the stem which, is, which it cast slightly where the stem and the grape meet. And with that. The grape painting is complete and this is the full mm. painting on which I have the grapes you can see and the plum which I have on this is the same plum this exact same. The plum in this painting is a full tutorial on my Patreon with full color mixing, reference, line drawing and the materials list step by step in real time. So if you'd like to give it a go you can check out my Patreon membership. I hope this mini tutorial was helpful. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comments and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.